Hey guys, LF Tech here, and we're taking a look at Vector, a robot that promises not to take over the world. If you're new to this channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button to get alerts on upcoming reviews. LF Tech provides quick, fast reviews on lots of products. In the box, you get Vector, a docking station, his cube, and random instructions. Setup is pretty simple, just download the app, follow the step-by-step, -step, and in about 10 minutes or so, you should be up and running. So you can think of Vector as a pet Google Home or Alexa. He plays games, does tricks, and provides info all by voice command. Just say, hey Vector, wait for the cue, and then give him the command, like, hey Vector, what's the weather for today? Or, hey Vector, pop a wheelie. Or even more expanded questions via the connected internet, like, what is the distance between LA and San Francisco? Even with the available tricks and commands, he's also a robot that likes to just hang around. Even if you're not doing anything with him, he'll still be really active whether he's roaming around and exploring, observing his environment, or even just playing with his cube. He sleeps in his charger when no one's around, but when he sees or hears someone, he'll wake up and start to either roam around or interact with you. He has facial recognition for multiple people, and when his battery is low, he'll automatically return to home for charging. On the tech side, this is all done with a Qualcomm 200 platform, HD camera with 120 degree ultra wide field of vision, four microphones, infrared scanner, six axis IMU, high res color IPS display, and 2.4 gigahertz Wi-Fi connection. And to top all this off, Anki is continuing to push updates regularly with improvements and new commands. Just recently over the holidays, he got a Christmas and New Year's emote, and along with that, a full integration of Amazon Alexa. So how much does a personal playful robot cost? As of now, Vector is priced at $250. And at that price, you have to ask, what is Anki's target audience then? We can see this being mostly for tech enthusiasts. If you're into the remote control scene with drones, or always into the next smart home gadget, or even just needing a non-human friend, this is gonna be for you. His response times for commands is fairly quick as long as you wait for the queue, but the list of commands at this point is a little short. His utilities are pretty nice with photos, timers, and a bunch more, but hopefully will be expanded on. Integration of Alexa is great, but we would love to see Google Assistant as well. And the price being $250 is fairly steep, but worth it if you're into something like this. We're gonna give this a very solid nine out of 10 vectors. On our side, we really like this little guy and are very excited to see what updates he gets next. Check out the link below for more information on Vector. Hit that like button if you liked this video and don't forget to subscribe to get alerts on future reviews.